Sebelum menonton, jangan lupa like, subscribe, dan tekan tombol lonceng. Selamat menyaksikan. Iran's interior ministry said Saturday that Masoud Pazashkian, a moderate who pledged to open Iran to the world and deliver freedoms its people have yearned for, has won the country's runoff presidential vote. Pazashkian is a 69-year-old cardiac surgeon, lawmaker and former health minister. He's the sole moderate among an original field of four candidates, and his main opponent was Saeed Jalili, a hardline ex-nuclear negotiator who called for deeper ties with Russia and China. The participation rate in the runoff election was about 50%. It follows a ballot on June 28th in the Islamic Republic that saw a historically low turnout. Over 60% of Iranian voters abstained from the snap election for a successor to Ibrahim Raisi, following his death in a helicopter crash. Activists at home and abroad have called for an election boycott, with painful memories of a violent state crackdown after protests in 2022 that were sparked by the death of Masa Amini, a woman who died in custody after allegedly violating the Islamic dress code. While faithful to Iran's theocratic rule, Zeshkian has in the past questioned authorities about their handling of Amini's death. The elections come as pressure ramps up in the region over the war in Gaza. Analysts say Pazachkian's win might result in a more pragmatic foreign policy for Iran. These tensions over now stalled talks with major powers to revive a 2015 nuclear deal and improve prospects for social liberalization and political pluralism. However, some voters tell Reuters they're skeptical about Pazachkian's ability to fulfill campaign promises, as he's publicly said before he doesn't intend to confront Iran's power elite of clerics and security hawks.